Hello students, I am Dr. Amit Bhatnagar, working as Senior Research Officer in the Department of Agronomy at G.B. Panth University of Agriculture and Technology, Panthnagar, Uttarakhand. Today, I will explain about the water lost during ET. How many liter water is wasted in atmosphere if there is a 1 millimeter evapotranspiration in the field. So, there is a relationship between the mm, centimeter and liter and we have to learn about the this relationship. If there is a 1 millimeter ET or 2 millimeter ET or 3 millimeter evapotranspiration in the field, so how many liter water is evaporated into the atmosphere. So, this is a sort of relationship. It is a, a mathematical relationship we can say and it is very concept based. And similarly, we can know how much water is in the field if there is a 1 millimeter rainfall or 2 millimeter rainfall or 7 millimeter rainfall. And similar manner, if we are giving uh, 5 centimeter irrigation or 6 centimeter irrigation in 1 hectare area, so how much liter water is given in the field. So, there is a mathematical relationship. This is simple relationship and to understand this relationship, uh, we know that to density of water, this is the basic lecture, density of water is, we know it is 1. But what is the unit? What is the 1? We ignore the unit. We should know what is the unit. Generally, we say that density of water is 1, but we ignore the unit. What is the unit? Unit is gram per cc. Now, what is cc? It is 1 gram per cc. Actually, cc is cubic centimeter. So, density of water is 1 gram per cubic centimeter. So, now what is the meaning of this 1 gram cc or 1 gram per cubic centimeter? So remember the unit, what is the unit? It means if volume is, the density means if volume is 1 cubic centimeter, then weight of water, weight of water is 1 gram. This is the meaning of this density. Density explain the weight per unit volume. So, if volume is 1 cubic centimeter, then weight of water is 1 gram. This is a very simple relationship. So, it means 1 cubic centimeter. 1 cubic centimeter means, if volume is 1 cubic centimeter, it means length is 1 centimeter, width is 1 centimeter and height is 1 centimeter. So, you make a cube, the length is 1 centimeter, width is 1 centimeter and height is 1 centimeter. So, this is a cube and the volume is 1 cubic centimeter and we fill this cubic with water, then weight of water will be 1 gram. So, this is the meaning of density. Make a cube of 1 centimeter length, then weight is 1 gram. Okay. So, this is simple relationship. Now, 1 cubic centimeter weight is 1 gram. So, we can rewrite it as 1 centimeter into 1 centimeter by 1 centimeter weight is 1 gram. We can rewrite it as. Now, convert centimeter into meter and we know that 100 centimeter is equal to 1 meter. A simple relationship. So, 1 centimeter is equal to 1 upon 100 meter. So, if we want to convert centimeter into meter, then it can be rewrite as 1 upon 100 meter multiplied by 1 upon 100 meter, then multiplied by 1 upon 100 meter. And weight is this meter and weight is 1 gram. This simple conversion of centimeter into meter. Now, this is 1 upon 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10 to power 6. Now, this is cubic meter, meter multiplied by meter multiplied by meter, cubic meter. Weight is 1 gram. Okay. So, 
further we can rewrite it as this 1 cubic meter is equal to 10 to power 6 gram so it means if volume is 1 cubic meter then the weight of water in this volume will be 10 to power 6 gram and we know that 1000 gram is equal to 1 kilogram so we can convert it into kilogram by dividing 1000 so now it is kilogram now it is 1000 kilogram so if volume is 1 cubic meter then weight of water will be 1000 kilogram so this is based on density this simple calculation we should know how it is obtained now we know that 1 kg water equal to 1 liter so it means we can rewrite it as 1 cubic meter volume will contain 1000 liter water so this is the way how it is obtained so if 1 cubic meter volume is there suppose 1 meter length 1 meter length 1 meter width and 1 meter height of any a cube or any tank and volume is 1 cubic meter and we fill the water in 1 cubic this tank then the weight is 1000 kg or volume is 1000 liter so this is the simple calculation so this is the reason that if there is a 1 cubic meter water it means the volume of water is 1000 liter or weight of water is 1000 kg it is very simple calculation and another calculation is that 1 kg water is equal to 1 liter water so we can rewrite it as 1000 gram we can write 1 kg into 1000 gram water is equal to and liter can be written in milliliter to so 1000 milliliter because in 1 liter there are 1000 ml so it means 1 gram water is equal to 1 ml so this is another relationship most of the students think that that uh, 1 milligram is equal to 1 ml water most of the students think that this is the relationship but this relationship is wrong this is wrong relationship 1 milligram water is is equal to not 1 ml this is the correct relationship 1 gram water is equal to 1 ml yaad rakhe ki 1 milligram 1 ml water ke equal nahi hota hai 1 milliliter water 1 gram water ke equal hota hai is baat ko dhyan rakhe aur 1 cubic meter water mein 1000 ml hote hain ye humko yaad rakhna hai this is simple relationship now a crop is growing in 1 hectare area अब इसको हम ऐसे समझते हैं कि how much water is lost in one millimeter ET. Suppose it is one hectare area and crop is actively growing crop is there and in one hectare area ET loss ET loss is equal to one millimeter. So how much water is lost? How many liter water is lost into atmosphere from the soil? Now area is equal to one hectare and water loss is one millimeter. Then we have to convert this into liter. Now calculate first calculate the volume. What is the volume? We have to first calculate what is the total volume of the water. Now area volume is equal to volume is equal to area into height. We know this is the simple relationship. Now here area is 1 hectare and height of water that is evaporated is 1 millimeter. Is crop, is area se 1 millimeter water ka jo paani tha field se yahaan evaporate kar gaya. So height is 1 millimeter. And for the calculation all the unit should be same. Koi bhi calculation jo ki jati hai 
तो उसमें यूनिट सेम होनी चाहिए अदरवाइज उनमें हम कोई आंसर ऑप्टेंट नहीं कर सकते तो यहाँ इसको हमें कन्वर्ट करना पड़ेगा नाउ हेक्टर इज कन्वर्टेड इंटू स्क्वायर मीटर एंड मिलीमीटर इज कन्वर्टेड इंटू मीटर तो वन हेक्टर इज इक्वल टू टेन थाउजेंड स्क्वायर मीटर एंड वन थाउजेंड मिलीमीटर इज इक्वल टू वन मीटर सो वी कैन राइट इट एज वन मिलीमीटर इक्वल टू वन थाउजेंड मीटर दिस इज सिंपल रिलेशनशिप नाउ वन टू थ्री वन टू थ्री इट इज टेन क्यूबिक मीटर सो If one millimeter water is lost, it means ten cubic meter water is lost from the field. So it is equal. It means it is ten cubic meter water is lost in one hectare area. In one hectare area. Now convert in into one cubic meter into liter. We know that one cubic meter is equal to one thousand liter. So now it is ten into one thousand. That that is ten thousand liter. So if there is a one millimeter loss of water, it means ten thousand liter water is lost from the field. If it is two mm water, this is in hectare. Remember that it is for one hectare area. If area is changed, then put the area value here. Then we calculate the amount of water in two hectare area, three hectare area, four. 4.5 whatever so this is the basic calculation if 2 mm then 20000 liter water is lost if 3 mm it means 30000 liter water is lost from the field so this is the calculation in general field there is one two uh, mm water loss in general and in hot summer uh, it is about 7 mm or 8 mm hardly 8 mm तो ये एक जनरल वैल्यू है कि एक से दो एम एम तीन एम तक जो है वाटर लॉस होता है ईटी से और समर सीजन में बहुत ज़्यादा हो तो आठ नौ एम तक ईटी हो सकता है तो ये डिपेंड करता है क्लाइमेटिक कंडीशंस क्या है बहुत ज़्यादा अगर हीट हो रही है तो बहुत ज़्यादा वाटर लॉस होगा इन जनरल इट इज टू टू थ्री एम सो ये दिस इज द अमाउंट ऑफ वाटर लॉस सिमिलरली इफ दिस इरीगेशन इज गिवन सपोज वी आर गिविंग इरीगेशन और रेनफॉल सपोज ऑन ए डे रेनफॉल इज सपोज ट्वेल्व एम एम तो हाउ मच वाटर इज ऑप्टेंड इन वन हेक्टर एरिया अगर ट्वेल्व एम एम रेनफॉल होता है किसी पर्टिकुलर डे में तो कितना वाटर जो है एक हेक्टर एरिया में रिसीव होगा दैट इज वेरी सिंपल कैलकुलेशन उसको हम कैलकुलेट कर सकते हैं सपोज ऑन ए पर्टिकुलर डे रेनफॉल इज ट्वेल्व एम एम सो इन वन हेक्टर एरिया वी नो दैट इन वन हेक्टर एरिया वन मिलीमीटर वाटर इक्वल टू टेन थाउजेंड लीटर सो ट्वेल्व एम एम रेनफॉल इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व इंटू टेन थाउजेंड It means one to one lakh twenty thousand liter water is obtained if there is twelve mm rainfall. So in this way we can calculate how much water is obtained from rainfall. So जितना mm rainfall हुआ है एक mm ten thousand liter के equal होता है उसके according कर सकते हैं. Similarly, if irrigation is given, five centimeter irrigation is given in the field. so how much water is in the field now convert this 5 cm first into mm by multiplying it by 10 because 10 mm is equal to uh, 10 mm is equal to 1 cm so now it is 50 mm so it means 5 cm irrigation equal to 50 mm now we know that 1 mm This is for one hectare area. Remember that this calculation is for one hectare area, and accordingly, uh, if area is changed, then calculation is changed. So one millimeter water equal to ten thousand liter. So five centimeter water means fifty millimeter. Convert it into millimeter is equal to ten thousand multiplied by five. That is 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव इट इज फाइव लैख लीटर सो इफ फाइव सेंटीमीटर इरीगेशन इज गिवन इट मीन्स फाइव लीटर वाटर वी आर गिविंग इन द फील्ड सो दिस इज द कैलकुलेशन हाउ इट इज कैलकुलेटेड सो वी कैन कैलकुलेट हाउ मच वाटर इज लॉस्ट इन ई टी हाउ मच वाटर इज ऑप्टेंड फ्रॉम रेनफॉल एंड हाउ मच वाटर इज गिवन इन इरीगेशन सो दिस इज द सिंपल कैलकुलेशन एंड दिस इज फॉर वन हेक्टर एरिया अगर हमको किसी उसमें कन्वर्ट करना है जैसे हम ये पता है कि वन मिलीमीटर इज टेन थाउजेंड लीटर इट इज इन वन हेक्टर एरिया और सपोज हमको निकालना हो कि इफ वन मिलीमीटर ई टी इन टू हेक्टर एरिया तो नाउ मल्टीप्लाइड बाई टेन थाउजेंड बाई टू सो दिस सैम्पल कैलकुलेशन इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो इफ वन मिलीमीटर वन मिलीमीटर वाटर ई टी इज लॉस्ट इन जीरो पॉइंट फोर हेक्टर एरिया देन मल्टीप्लाइड टेन थाउजेंड मल्टी जीरो पॉइंट फोर हेक्टर तो दिस इज सिंपल कैलकुलेशन और यदि हमको पता करना हो कि हमें थ्री थाउजेंड हेक्टर थ्री थाउजेंड स्क्वायर मीटर एरिया दिया हो तो तो कैसे इसको हम निकालेंगे तो नाउ कन्वर्ट दिस थ्री थाउजेंड स्क्वायर मीटर एरिया इन टू हेक्टर बाई डिवाइडिंग टेन थाउजेंड सो इट मीन इट इज जीरो पॉइंट थ्री हेक्टर नाउ मल्टीप्लाई टेन थाउजेंड बाई जीरो पॉइंट थ्री तो टेन थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाई जीरो पॉइंट थ्री बिकॉज दिस इज इन वन हेक्टर एरिया एंड वी आर कैलकुलेटिंग फॉर जीरो पॉइंट थ्री हेक्टर so it is 3000 liter so this is the calculation how we can calculate the amount of water and this is very basic lecture how 1 mm water is equal to 10000 liter it is a simple calculation based on density of water and the basic formula is calculation of volume on the basis of area and height height means amount of water lost or depth of irrigation or uh, depth of rainfall so this was very basic lecture i hope aapko lecture acha laga hoga thank you very much